If your soil has lost its life, don't give up on it just yet. Whether you're dealing with compacted dirt, nutrient depletion, or poor water retention, there are plants that can restore soil health naturally. Instead of relying on synthetic fertilizers or expensive amendments, you can use nature's own tools, plants that enrich the earth, break up tough soil, and bring beneficial microbes back into action. Today we'll explore five powerhouse plants that will help you transform dead soil into a rich, fertile growing space. Clover the Nitrogen Booster. Clover is a game changer for soil restoration. It's a legume, meaning it pulls nitrogen from the air and deposits it directly into the soil. If your garden has been stripped of nutrients after years of heavy feeding crops, Clover can naturally replenish it. Beyond nitrogen fixation, clover also improves soil structure, prevents erosion, and suppresses weeds. White clover is ideal for pathways or between raised beds, while crimson clover is perfect for cover cropping. Simply plant it, let it grow, and when it reaches maturity, mow or till it into the soil to create a nutrient-dense foundation for your next planting cycle. Even if you leave it to decompose naturally, it will feed the microbes and encourage earthworms, both essential for healthy soil. Comfrey the Deep Miner Comfrey is a must-have if you're looking to unlock deep soil nutrients. With roots that can extend several feet underground, it draws up essential minerals like potassium, calcium, and phosphorus from deep below the surface. These nutrients accumulate in its leaves, which can then be used as mulch, compost, or a powerful natural fertilizer. Comfrey is also one of the best plants for breaking up compacted soil. If you're struggling with hard, unworkable ground, planting comfrey will gradually loosen it over time. Its broad lush foliage shades the soil, reducing moisture loss and preventing erosion. You can chop comfrey leaves and use them to fertilize other plants or make a nutrient-rich liquid fertilizer by soaking them in water. Just be mindful of where you plant it. Once established, comfrey is difficult to remove, so give it a dedicated space. Daikon Radish, the Soil Loosener If you have hard, compacted soil, Daikon Radish is one of the best natural solutions. Its long, thick tap roots penetrate deep into tough soil layers, improving aeration and water infiltration. This helps future crops develop stronger root systems and access nutrients more easily. Daikon radishes are often grown as a cover crop and left to decompose in place over winter. As the roots break down, they create channels that improve soil structure, making it easier for new plants to establish themselves. They also add organic matter, feeding beneficial microbes that contribute to long-term soil health. Another benefit is that daikon radish suppresses weeds, making it an excellent choice for preparing garden beds ahead of the growing season. Buckwheat, the fast-acting soil builder. If you need quick results, buckwheat is your go-to plant. This fast-growing cover crop improves soil in as little as 30 to 40 days. It's particularly effective at breaking up compacted dirt, improving drainage, and making phosphorus more available, an essential nutrient that many garden soils lack. Buckwheat isn't just beneficial underground, its above-ground benefits include attracting pollinators and beneficial insects with its delicate white flowers. Once it reaches maturity, it can be mowed down and incorporated into the soil, adding a burst of organic matter that feeds microbes and enriches fertility. Because it decomposes quickly, buckwheat is perfect for preparing the ground for future crops. Alfalfa, the ultimate soil enhancer. 
Alfalfa is another nitrogen-fixing plant but its benefits go even further. With roots that can grow up to 10 feet deep, alfalfa brings up nutrients from the subsoil and improves overall soil aeration. If you have poor depleted ground, planting alfalfa can make a significant difference over time. Not only does it improve soil structure, but it also serves as a natural fertilizer when tilled under. Many gardeners grow alfalfa as a mulch crop or compost ingredient because of its high nitrogen content. Additionally, it attracts pollinators and beneficial insects that help keep pest populations in check. If you're looking for a long-term solution to revitalizing your soil, alfalfa is an excellent choice. Reviving dead soil isn't an overnight process, but with the right plants, you can speed up the transformation. Clover and alfalfa fix nitrogen, comfrey mines deep nutrients, daikon radish aerates compacted soil, and buckwheat boosts organic matter in record time. By incorporating these plants into your gardening routine, you'll create a thriving, self-sustaining soil ecosystem. Once your soil is back to life, keep it healthy by adding compost regularly, rotating crops, and using mulch to retain moisture. A well-maintained soil structure ensures long-term success, giving you healthier plants, better yields, and a more resilient garden. If this guide helped you, don't forget to subscribe to Hydrohaven for more expert gardening and soil restoration tips. Share this with fellow gardeners who might be struggling with poor soil, and let's build better gardens together, one plant at a time.